Hello guys, welcome to my second book. So today I'm going to be teaching you how to use the NTP servers on True Guys Core. So without further ado, let's begin this tutorial. Okay, so as you can see, I'm at the True Nest Core login page, and of course, I'm going to have to log in. I'll type that in correctly. Okay, so you can see I'm at the dashboard. So, uh, in order to manage the NTP servers, we need to go to System and click on NTP servers. So, you can see we have three NTP servers so far. They're all from the um, freebsd.org server, and we have two of them. So, in order to add, add our own, I <coughs> have to go and add. Now, first of all, we have the address. So, for instance, I can say ntp.example.com. And here we have our options. So, we have burst, first of all. And as you can see, there's a bit of uh, information here. Uh, iBurst is mainly, uh, I think, to speed things up a bit. Yeah, speeds up the initial synchronization in seconds and in minutes. You can have the prefer option. And you can also set the minimum poll and the maximum poll, and you can force it as well, should you prefer. So with that, we can press submit. Obviously, this will not work, uh, because this is obviously ntp.example.com. But there you go. Also, we have columns as well, so we can unselect all, and we can actually... Um, you know, check which ones have got the max poll, which ones the minimum poll, what's the preferred option, what's the eye burst, is it on, 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 yes, burst, no, 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 we can just check everything and we can see what's up with all the NTP servers. In order to remove one, we go into the three options here and we click on delete. Hit confirm and delete. And that's it. Hopefully this video has been helpful. If you'd like to request a video, please leave a comment in the comment section below, or you can check out our Discord server, Twitter, and Instagram pages, which are the links in the video description. Join me next time as I'll be teaching you how to look at the boot uh, op options, and uh, what exactly we can do with that. But with that, thank you very much for watching.